Make sure you check out our new sponsor, the Health Blaze. All the information is in the description. Use the promo code above. Good filler one boxing at 18% off of all their natural products from deodorant, pomade, toothpaste, and much, much more. And they have additional discounts on their website as well. That's the healthblaze.com. Start December 20th. That promo code is good for 18% off. We go. What's going on? We back talking about Anthony Yard and his team, um, his coach, Ajayi whatever his name is, uh, they did appear interviews, both with IFL TV, and um, explaining how they're going to duck Sergey Kovalev. So let's get into it. Don't forget, you can find us on all social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and my email is all in the description. However you want to contact me, if you want to follow some of our content on social media. And don't forget to check out our sponsor, The Help Blaze, thehelpblaze.com. Promo code goodfellow one boxing get you 18% off the 100% all natural products. Lotion soaps, foot soaks, bath bombs, deodorant, toothpaste, hair pomade, lip balm, and much, much more. Website promo code are both in the description. And um, let's chop it up. And um, I caught the Ajayi, whatever his name is, coach, um, interview. And basically, he tried to assassinate Sergey Kovalev's uh, pulling power in America, saying that, you know, Kovalev fought at a sports arena in America in Texas. Nobody was there. We went to Atlantic City, and I guess to watch him lose to Alvarez the first fight. I don't know why I was here. And Anthony Joshua puts a ton of asses in the seats in um, the UK. You know, he pointed out, Floyd said he was never fighting in in London. He said Floyd never fought in London. So, um, so basically, they don't want to fight Kovalev in America. Said that the officiating is sketchy over in America, according to Frank Warren. And they want to do the fight over there in the UK. And if Kovalev fails to come to the UK, they ain't doing a the fight. <laughs> they ain't doing a fight. You know what I'm saying? So he kept pointing out that Adidas, Adidas, that's what he said. Uh, it, you know, Anthony Joshua was the first global brand ambassador. And, you know, basically saying, you know, uh, you know, Anthony Yard pulling power, you know, was good too, even though Kovalev is more known universally. And everybody know that. Nobody know who Anthony Yard is in the States. I'm not saying the Kovalev is a, is a huge household name in the States, but nobody know who, who Joshua, I mean, what Yard is. Baby Joshua. <laughs> do 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 do. <laughs> you know, baby Joshua. Do 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 do. <laughs> Anthony Yard, man. And they find a way out this fight. So if Kovalev doesn't oblige to come over to the UK, then um, that fight won't happen. That's what I took away from it. And Yard is saying that he'll knock Kovalev out. They don't want to fight Kovalev. I'm Kovalev. I ain't going to the UK. I'm trying to unify with Beevil or, or another one, whoever you want to unify with. And, and that's how I'm rocking. Plain point, period, to the point. <laughs> I'm not fighting Anthony Yard. Anthony Yard don't bring shit to the table. I beat Anthony Yard. All I do, I might become a legend in the UK for putting down a hype job, but obviously this dude ain't ready to fight. Obviously they continue to move the goalposts. Obviously Frank Warren... They moved him wrong. They 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 just didn't move the kid right. He got too much muscle, and once that blood and oxygen fill in the muscle, he gonna get tired. And um, you know, Kovalev gonna stop this kid regardless. You know, and this kid is gonna find a way out. To, find a way out of this fight. They are gonna pass up another mandatory unless Kovalev call their bluff and come to the UK. But what killing me? What killed me about the oh the fishy in the United States? If Kovalev ain't no pool in the United States, right? Then you know why why should um. You know, why is he going to get the benefit of the doubt? You know, they're playing that shit off the Tyson Fury for all they... That everything is for Frank Warren is going to be off the strength. The Tyson Fury, they claim the Tyson Fury got robbed from Deontay Wilder. He got knocked out. Real talk, he got knocked out. <laughs> and I don't believe Tyson Fury won all six of the first rounds. I had it four rounds to two Fury. You know what I'm saying? But you got knocked out. And let's talk about the sketchy officiating in the U.K., all them fights with Ricky Burns got the benefit of the doubt. The Malik Scott and Derek Chisora fight with the fishy ending. And on, on top of that, the ending competition and, and the UKD and the UK and the UK being able to let their fighters juice all the way into the day of the fight. Let's talk about how sketchy the UK is. Let's not act like Anthony Yard ain't, ain't yoked up. You know, Billy Joe Saunders won't take a shit. Tyson Fury won't take a shit. And anybody that believes Tyson Fury lost a hundred and some pounds naturally in that short of time is smoking moon rocks. Real talk. They smoking moon rocks. So let's just keep it factual, man. 
They trying to act like the UK is the, the, the pearly golden gates for boxing where everything is fair and square. And your fighters over there cheating. We heard about the Anthony Joshua thing with the with the exemptions for, you know, therapeutic testosterone therapy, whatever they call it. You know what I'm saying? We seen all the sketchy decisions before over there. We seen with sketchy we seen sketchy shit with your referees, even in all UK fights, when the first Groves and Frosh fight, that was the sketchy stoppage. So let's not act like the UK is the end all be all for perfect boxing judging. Y'all be over there cheating, y'all refs is BS, and y'all be robbing fighters. And Frank Warren fighters be cheating, man. Yard, Fury, both cheating. I mean, Fury, excuse me, Fury and Billy Joe Saunders both cheated. And, and, and they bring them dudes over to the ESPN like anybody cares. Nobody cares about Carl Frampton. Nobody cares about Tyson Fury. Nobody cares about Billy Joe Saunders. People care about the best fighting the best. If they over there, you know, bum bashing and fighting vagabonds, nobody cares. And Anthony Yard is just finding, finding a way to get out the fight. You come to America to watch the dude fight. You come to America and train every now and again. He a walking lick, bro. That dude is an easy out for any top 10 contender probably in light heavyweight division. You know what I'm saying? And they gonna, they gonna, I knew they wasn't going to fight Kovalev unless Kovalev submit to them. And how you, and how you the A-side and you ain't never fought nobody, bro? You ain't, I mean, this is the champion. You know what I'm saying? And I was explaining yesterday to people, oh, it should be 50-50 between Wilder and Joshua. How? Anthony Joshua will bring three belts to the table. But the hypocrisy is if Errol Spence to bring three belts to the table, right? And Bud only bring one. Oh, how's it 50-50? I'm telling you, these dudes is, is wishy-washy out here, man. For real, these dudes is wishy-washy. I mean... How is you how other than Canelo, other than people with Canelo, Pacquiao, Mayweather Pool, how are you telling how are you telling me that's 50 50? How are you telling me a champion, a guy that been champion multiple times, that um he ain't the A side. The, 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 the guys who ain't never fought nobody the A side. The guys who have zero notoriety in the United States is the A side. A guy who ain't fought a guy with a post is the A side. Because you got a, a, a ambassador deal with Adidas? Hey, newsflash, Adidas behind Jordan, behind Jordan, Nike, behind Champion now, and behind Fila now in the United States. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Real talk. As far as popularity, they're behind. This ain't run DMC, bro. My Adidas ain't that no more, bro. He got the Adidas brand ambassador deal. We ain't seen you on one Adidas uh, poster and and, and and no Nike, and no uh, New York, no Detroit, no LA, no Dallas, Texas, wherever, Florida. We ain't seen this dude on one Adidas commercial on my TV screen. You a brand and global brand ambassador, but you how you not global in one of the most fruitful markets for uh, sneaker and athletic apparel? How? It's just a way to get that way. Get that on fake belts he got there. And, and, we, and Weasel is without the Kovalev fight. And I'm Kovalev. I ain't fighting in no UK. Y'all come over here. And we ain't got no fight. We ain't got no fight. WBO take him out the rankings. Excuse me. Take him out the rankings. It's plain and simple as that. Take him out the rankings. But, hey. I already knew they was going to Weasel they self out the fight. And then, Anthony, I could knock this guy out. And, and this and that and that. And this. Yeah, all right, man. If you can knock him out. The best thing about being a champion is going to enemy territory and getting the belt. You know what I'm saying? Now now you got guys that's, that's, that ain't done nothing in their career like Anthony Yard. Ain't got a pot to piss in the sport of boxing like Anthony Yard. Trying to tell guy, veteran guys who've been world champion before, who currently are world champion, and trying to call the shots. No, it don't work that way. If I'm the WBO, I'm banishing him from my rankings. If you don't take this fight and they duck a purse bit or whatever situation may be, he don't take this fight. Get out of my rankings. I will not re be re-ranking Anthony Yard again. He's wasting our time. Go somewhere else. That's as simple as that, man. But y'all know what it is, man. Goodfellas Sports TV. Appreciate everybody for showing love. Don't forget, we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out to the email if you have a business question, inquiry, response, share video requests. Um, other than that, man, you can follow, check our Facebook group out. Don't forget to check out our Patreon. Two dollars for the hardcore boxing fan. Now I got $2 for food for thought and um, my hood series here. That's one tier. 
So two different tiers, but um, I'll be uh, updating it really, really soon. Um, other than that, don't forget to check out our sponsor, The Hellblaze, TheHellBlaze.com. Promo code GoodFellow1Boxing. Get you 18% off the 100% all natural products with soaps, lotions, foot soaps, bath bombs, and much, much more. Go check them out, and we're doing giveaways this week as well. Goodfellow Sports TV, boy CJ, Goodfellow, we go.